A Glimpse into the Soul, Unraveling Anthony Van Dyke's The Penitent Magdalene. Anthony Van Dyke's masterpiece, The Penitent Magdalene, painted circa 1620, is a profound exploration of repentance and divine grace. This artwork, imbued with historical and spiritual contexts, exemplifies the artist's mastery in portraying complex human emotions and the ethereal beauty of religious narratives. Van Dyck's technique is characterized by his use of undulating contours to depict the human form. The saint's body, elegantly rendered with a delicate play of light and shadow, exhibits a softness that contrasts with the robust brushwork of his contemporary, Peter Paul Rubens. The landscape in the background, possibly executed by a specialist collaborator due to its distinct handling style, adds depth and context to Magdalene's introspective moment. The Penitent Magdalene is believed to be created during Van Dyck's first Antwerp period, c. 1613-20, showcasing his evolving artistic styles that were not chronologically linear but rather simultaneous expressions of his creative genius. The painting shares stylistic affinities with other works like Jupiter and Anchope in Cologne and Ghent. Saint Mary Magdalene is depicted as a composite personality derived from New Testament passages. She embodies repentance, her presence at significant events in Christ's life underscores her journey from sin to sanctity. In this artwork, Van Dyck captures Magdalene in an intimate moment of reflection, an embodiment of divine grace accessible to all who seek redemption. While distinct in execution style, Van Dyck was influenced by Rubens' configuration of figures. The slanted pose and upper body portrayal are reminiscent yet uniquely interpreted from Rubens' works like Magdalene renouncing earthly goods. The penitent Magdalene stands as testament to Anthony Van Dyck's inventive genius, an intricate dance between earthly vulnerability and divine grace encapsulated within each brushstroke. It invites viewers into a contemplative space where artistry meets spirituality amidst historical echoes that continue to resonate through time.